Hi, I'm Jason from AC Delco. I'm here today with my buddy Chris, who went to get a part. We're working on a vehicle that has a clicking noise coming from under the dash. We've isolated the problem to an HVAC actuator. Did you get the part? Sure did, AC Delco, just like you asked for. Great. While I'm installing the part, why don't you explain what I'm doing under the dash? Sounds great, Jason. You know, the great thing about these AC Delco actuators is they're designed to be installed right out of the box. Let me show you what Jason's doing on the vehicle. He's removed the glove box door to gain access to the actuator. Now the actuator he's installing is fairly simple to access, but as technicians we know that's not always the case. Some technicians may choose to test the actuator prior to installing it. However, this could lead to installation issues, it may be inoperative after it's installed, or could set a DTC. Here's an example of an actuator that's been run outside of the operating range. This is visible by the center slot of the actuator hub being outside of the two alignment marks on the outer case. Let me show you how to bring that back into range. After referring to the service information for the proper pin terminal locations, using a 9 volt battery, apply battery positive to pin terminal 5, which would be indicated by the furthest terminal to the right in the connector cavity. Apply battery negative to pin terminal 7 to complete the circuit. Look for actuator movement. If there's no actuator movement, that would indicate that the actuator is up against an internal stop in the actuator case. Remove pin terminal 7 and simultaneously touch pin terminal 6 and 7 to complete the circuit. Look for actuator operation in the opposite direction. Continue to hold the circuit until the actuator center slot is between the two outer case alignment marks which would indicate that it's back within its normal operating range. Now the actuator is ready to be installed in the vehicle. Plug in the connector and run the system through its modes to verify proper operation. Okay, the actuator is installed. Did you test it? Doing it right now. Sounds great. I thought it was important to mention while Jason's testing the system that these actuators are commonly used on General Motors and many other manufacturers' vehicles and should be recalibrated after installation. All modes are working and no clicking. Another job well done. I'm Jason, thanks for watching. And I'm Chris, thanks for choosing AC Delco. Peace.